Hey, we're in and welcome back to some more Battle Brothers. So, we got 3000 gold, but I'm not spending it just yet. Let's check out the contract and see how much gold we can get from that one. 1000 crowns, okay, that's not too bad. Defend the town against raiding parties. We can do that. Alright, let's do that then. That's going to be 4000 if we can get it done. We should be fine. I'll just have to buy some food sometime soon. Can't do it right now, we're in the middle of the night. So, are they coming? Alright, let's just buy some food because I'm about to run out. We got smoked ham. Let's just buy some ground grains. And some fish. Yep, sounds good. And I might sell some of the armor. Yeah, we won't need armor with 20. That's just bad. Yeah, that's good enough for now. Maybe an axe or two. Here. The woodcutter's axe is actually kind of bad. Might as well sell all of them. One spear. One pickaxe. Okay, good enough. So, are they coming or what? Come on now. We're waiting. Any day now. Hello? Oh, yep, they are coming. Okay, then. There they are. A few thugs, a poacher, a marksman, and a few raiders. Should be fine. I let them come closer to the caravan. Okay, then. So, it's mostly the poacher and the marksman that might be a problem. If we could kill them quickly, then it would make our life much, much easier. Let's give it a shot. There we go, nice one. He has pierced leg muscles. Okay, good. Fortunately, they won't get high ground. Well, he can move here, but then I will be able to kill him quite easily. Alright. So let them shoot first, and then we'll start moving. Yeah, we can start moving now, I think. I'll probably have to charge them. I think so. Alright, let's go then. Will they move towards us? Doesn't look like they are eager to do that. Okay, fine. Yeah, they will not move towards us. That's fine. We got some help from the caravan. That might come in handy. Yeah, let these guys charge first. That's perfect. This should actually be a pretty easy fight. But let's not get overconfident. These guys seem to have pretty good gear. Alright, you can go here. And like this. Alright, bring it on. We need to kill that poacher and the marksman. Hopefully they will target the caravan people now. Okay, there are quite a few of them. We got a total of 22 people on our side. <laughs> okay, that's actually pretty crazy. Nice one, we almost killed him. Just with Egbert, nice. Okay, let's see what they are going to do. Yeah, I'll move my guys to the end of the queue for now. Yep, and let our caravan friends attack first, it's fine. That's the marksman, or the poacher rather. We killed the marksman. Okay, yep, let them engage first, it's fine. We can help with our two hunters. That's the general idea. Okay, yep, now we can move in a bit more. Maybe not like this because we'll block the way. Yeah, they don't exactly stand a chance. Where's the actual raider? Right here. Two raiders. Okay then. If that's the only raiding party, this is going to be the easiest 1000 we got so far, I think. Okay, that's fine. 
We still got that Poacher over there, but he doesn't really stand a chance. Hopefully we'll get a level up from this. Okay, six more guys left. About to be five. There's almost not enough space for everyone. Okay, we can use our two hunter and the miss. There we go, that's better. We actually got a kill. Alright then. Come on, let's finish this. Their morale is dropping. So they might actually flee sometime soon. Here, another one down. I'm pretty sure they will flee soon. Can't hit this guy, there's not enough space. He does have high ground and a shield, but that's not going to help him a whole lot. Definitely not. He's about to get completely surrounded, except for the tree. Knock him off the high ground, come on people. I don't think they are smart enough to do that. Oh well, he will die regardless. So, like that. And destroy the shield. You guys got an axe, you can do it. Nope, we missed. Okay then. So one more raider down here with the axe. And over here with a shield. Alright, let's just move in ourselves and we can do some damage. And we can destroy the shield ourselves. There we go, he's dead. That didn't take long. Not that I expected it to. And the other guy is fleeing. Yeah, we are pretty much done here. There's only one guy left who's not fleeing. Oh, and yeah, there's also the poacher. He's not fleeing yet. Alright then. He will. Come on, let's finish this. Oh, he actually tried to hit us. How rude. Let's try to get the poacher. Maybe we can do it. He's still trying to hit us. How cute. There we go, we're in range. Are we there yet? Come on, kill him already. There we go, he's down. Alright then. So, just the poacher left and he's fleeing. We're basically done here. We can probably run him down. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can. Unless he gets really lucky. He will try to escape, but we'll get attacks of opportunity. It's just that we got a lot of dudes to move. Come on, let's do this. Yeah, he's going to die. He doesn't stand a chance. There's no way he can escape. That's a lot of dudes. And he's dead. So, no level ups? Oh well, that's fine. Let's go collect our 1000. Yeah, looks like we're done, or are we? And no, there's going to be one more raiding party. Yeah, I'm okay with that. This was a pretty easy fight. Plus one ranged skill. Okay. Yep, here comes another raiding party. Let them get closer to the caravan. Because then we'll get help again. Here, many tags and a few poachers. Yeah, that won't be a problem at all. We got our caravan people. Yeah, this is going to be an even easier fight than previously. Because they don't even have any raiders. Just poachers. And thugs. Let them shoot first and then we'll move in. We don't want to make it easier for them. Okay, yep, let them shoot. And let our caravan friends move first. To make them a target. Yep, looks good. They do have a little bit of high ground. 
But that's not going to help them a whole lot. How many portraits do they have? I only see two. Three. Two of them have high ground. Alright. No problem. We got some high ground as well. We can move Egbert to the high ground. And that's probably the best way to go. So, Egbert. I can still take a shot from there. Okay, yeah. There we go, very nice. Pierced hand. That should lower his weapon skill. Alright, let's move in. Hopefully we'll get our 1000 after this. Yeah, 22 people on our side. <laughs> this is a slightly one-sided encounter. But hey, it's their fault. They are the ones raiding us, not other way around. Although it feels a little bit like it's the other way around. He tried to hit us, how cute. Yeah, they are about to get wrecked. So, over here. Or down here, doesn't really make a difference. Oh, they are moving in now. <laughs> to their doom. They are actually trying to attack us. I think that's called having a death wish. With their gear, yeah. <laughs> One shot. I almost feel sorry for them, but not really. Charge! Egbert? Yeah, let's hit the poacher. Nope. Oh well, you tried. That thug is about to have a bad time. Here, he's dead. Hopefully we'll get some level ups from this. It won't be a whole lot of experience, but should be enough. A few people are close, I think. At least, last I checked. Alright, go, go, go. Only seven dudes left. They will be going down pretty quickly. Okay, that will do. Yeah, their morale is already low. Breaking. Try to flank them a little. He actually had spear wall up. Didn't help him a whole lot. Go, go, go. Okay, we can hit one guy. Nice one. I think he's bleeding. Yeah, he has cut artery. And this one. Come on, let's get some more kills. For our guys. There we go, that's a kill. Can Egbert shoot someone safely? And uh, Not really. Let's not do that then. I don't want to hit my own people. Especially in the back. We might even be done on this turn, and if not, on the next one. Okay, he's almost dead. This fella. Goodbye. Yep, he's fleeing. Let's try to engage the other poacher, because he's not fleeing. Yeah, we can do that. Uh, hold on, maybe not. He's actually trying to hit us, how cute. Not for long. I can't do anything with Oscar. Not enough space. Yeah, that will do. This guy is fleeing, so he doesn't have zone of control. And now this spear thug is fleeing as well. Yep. We're pretty much done here. Just need to finish off the poacher. Shouldn't be too hard. Come on. Can Egbert do anything? Probably not, no. No, he's too far away. That's okay. And he's dead. So, just the poacher left. He is going down. Get over here.
Seriously, you missed? Come on now. Yep, he is pretty much dead. He has nowhere to go. He's almost completely surrounded. Sorry bro, this is definitely not your day. Better luck next time, except there won't be next time for you. We did get a level up, nice. Alright, I'll take all of that. And we should be done now, yep, we are, nice. So that's going to be 4000, very nice. Let's maybe buy some food. Uh, do we need food? No, I don't think we do. However, we do need medical supplies and they are pretty cheap in here. I might even buy two stacks because it's not easy to find them for 200. Yeah, let's buy two stacks. And we can sell some of these crappy weapons. Like so. Yep, sell all of that. 30, 30. We can sell the quiver, definitely. Okay, I think that's good enough for now. Oh yeah, and we can sell the wolf pelts. Although, I think they are used for some crafting, if I'm not mistaken. We can probably sell adrenaline gland, however. And we can also sell salt, that's a pretty good price. Let's do that then. Okay, so that's 4200. Let's check the recruits. I need to find that witch hunter. Not quite sure which town it was. It was one of the towns to the west. So I think we'll go there. Harbor. Okay, we can sail to one of these towns. Harkenstad? Where is that? Over here. No, I don't want to go there. Uh, let's just go. So, we are looking for good recruits. A lot of it depends on the facilities in town. Oh, I haven't visited this one, okay. Uh, hold on, we got some brigands. A brigand marksman and a few raiders. We can probably kill them. You know what, why not? Oh, hold on, I didn't check the level up. We got two level ups. Cory and Leonhard. Oh yeah, our banner guy. So he needs more resolve, that's for sure. Let's take the resolve. And probably hit points. And our defense. No, that would be only plus one defense. We can get the weapon skill. And either health or fatigue. I'm thinking health because we don't want him to get killed. As for the perks. He has Colossus and Student so far. And we need Fortified Mind. Which tier was that? This one. Yeah, we definitely need that. Resolve is increased by 25%. That's a no-brainer for a Bannerman. Yeah, definitely. There's also Rally the Troops. Right here. We could grab that first and then Fortified Mind. Although, no, I think I prefer Fortified Mind first. There it is. Alright then. So, let's attack the brigands. The marksmen can be pretty annoying, but there's only one. That shouldn't be a problem. There are only three people total in here. I don't think that's going to be an issue. So, move Egbert to the back of the queue for now. Yeah, we'll move our tanks first. And maybe let their marksmen take a shot. You know, to not make it easier for them. Uh, that would be best. Although, I want to start moving. There's the marksman. Right, let's start moving. Preferably as much as possible. How's Herman's defense? It's pretty good. Okay, let's move closer. Cory. Not yet. Yeah, everyone with a shield. Let's see if the raiders are going to engage us. I mean, there are only three of them. It's not like they have an advantage. They most certainly do not. And let's try to hit the marksman. 
Nope. Oh well. We did have a decent chance to hit him, but... Alas. It didn't quite work. Alright, let's go, people. We need to engage that marksman on our next turn. Hopefully we'll be able to do that. So he will take a shot first. Okay, he will back up first, that makes sense. They are all backing up, alright. Sure, whatever. Nice one. So I can actually move into his mana range. Let's do it! Yeah, let's do it. Herman has pretty decent armor. 90 and 140. Okay. So now, engage this guy. Might as well, so that he won't be able to move without triggering an attack. And I can hit him with two hunters. There we go, nice. He's already wavering. That didn't take long. Maybe engage this guy. You know, to help out Herman. That's what I'm thinking, yeah. Let's help out Herman then. Like so. You go this way. And finish off this guy. We can probably make him flee. Most likely, yeah. This way. To hit the marksman on the next turn. He might try to move. But if he does, we will get an attack. Yep, now he's fleeing good. Let's see. Can't quite hit this guy yet. We can hit him with Leonhard. There we go, nice. He's almost dead. And the marksman didn't try to move, good. We pretty much got this, I think. Let's try to hit this guy, he can do some pretty decent damage. Would be nice to kill him. Or at least wound him. Yeah, now we are bleeding. He needs to die quickly. There, the other raider is dead. We can probably force him to flee. Yeah, he's already breaking. Let's finish this quickly since we're bleeding. There, he's dead. We got this. Just need to finish off the marksman. I need to get more bandages. Because bleeds will become more and more common. I only got bandage equipped on like one person. Maybe two people. I need to check that. Here, we're done. We got some loot. And we got three level ups, nice. We got one more group of brigands, but I'm not sure if I want to engage them. Many tags and a few poachers. We can probably do it. But first, let's check the level ups. Let's see who has bandages. Okay, Guntram has a bandage. Herman has a bandage. And I think that's it. Yeah, I need bandages on more people. Anyway, level ups. And also, some helmets. I already got all the best armor equipped. That's 35... yeah, okay. But we've got some decent helmets now. 70, 105, that's the best one. No one in the front needs any more helmets. But people in the back could use them. Yeah, 40, 30... How about our Bannerman? Let's give him a better one. Like this. Who's the highest level in the back? Otwin is level 4. Level 5. Yeah, he needs a better helmet. So there you go. Then Otwin. I think we can give a decent helmet to everyone. Well, almost everyone. We got one more. It's a 28 durability, but we can repair that. So Grimwald, he can grab that. And I think that's it. We got helmets with 40. 45. Yeah, okay, that's basically it. Let's check the level ups now. First Herman, he's level 5 now. Let's see. Mala defense, mala skill, and I would say some hit points. 62 is a little bit low. As for perks, we got Shield Expert, and we got Steel Bro. 
So I'm thinking rotate. We need that on more people. It's just so good. Okay, rotation. Next up, Cory. Let's take a look. Hit points. Yeah, these options are kind of bad. But oh well. Okay, sure, fine. And still, bro, we need that on every tank. Then Geralt, level 5. Fatigue, melee defense, and I would say some hit points. He's a tank after all. And then rotation. I want rotation on every tank. It's just too good to ignore it. Yep, rotation. There it is. And that's it. So, do we attack that other group? Maybe. A few poachers shouldn't be more than like two or three. That shouldn't be a problem, I don't think so, unless they get really lucky in shooting us. We can also go check the quests at the nearest town. Yeah, let's just go check the quests. There's a wooden watchtower here, which means there should be better recruitment options. I'll just have to wait. Let's check the quests first. Oh, I think that was an escort. A drive of brigands. Okay, let's check the other one. 900 when done. Escort the caravan. Oh, that's the town all the way to the northeast. I might do that after the other contract. So let's just grab this one. It should be quick. Just drive off some brigands. Oh, over here. That's a little bit far away, but okay, I suppose we can do that. Yeah, alright, let's do it, it's fine. We got 77 food, that will be enough. And we got a lot of money now. Don't worry, I'll spend it. Probably for a good recruit and a good weapon. So, we don't know who we'll be fighting. Okay. I mean, it can't be that bad, right? Yeah, it's fine, they don't have anything ranged. So this will not be a problem whatsoever. And we got high ground. Yeah, this is going to be slightly one-sided, I think. You know, we could use one more tank, I think. We got a lot of people in the back row, but not too many in the front. Well, anyway, we can actually hit them right now if we want to. And move in with Herman. Yeah, let's hit them. 64, yeah, that was a good one. Okay, one more time. Nice. He's at half health already. That was a good start. But we need more people on this side. So first, Herman. And he probably won't use shield wall because, yeah, that's a lot of dudes that will be ganging up on us. Then Randolph from the flank. And send more help. No, I don't really want to be on the low ground. We could set up here. Or here. Okay, let's set up here, that's fine. Then engage the other raider. Might as well, yep. Yeah. 35%. Let's try destroy armor. Yep, that worked. And we'll have to destroy his shield. So Gontram can handle that. And everyone else will go south, I think. Well, maybe except Grimwald. You know what Grimwald needs? A better weapon. We'll probably spend our gold to upgrade his weapon. A pitchfork is just not good enough at this stage of the game. Certainly not. So, Leonhard here. Yep, that will do. So, this guy is using a front weapon. As far as I can tell. Nice. And the reload. Oh, this guy actually moved to the back. And he avoided attack of opportunity from us. Okay. Interesting. Well, I can't really move or I risk getting hit myself. 
Let's try to kill this dude quickly. I got 71% chance to hit him. As opposed to 44. There. Yeah, we can kill him on this turn. And we can use rotation to help Oscar. That's why I needed rotation for situations like this. He's already fleeing. So let's hit this guy, then move back one tile. Okay, Cory doesn't have rotation yet. Okay, we're fine. Randolph doesn't have rotation either. So, do we just move in like this? I can try to knock him back. There, that worked. Herman has rotation. But I would have to move, and I can't really do that right now. No, not really. Well then. Let's just hit this guy and kill him. And use shield wall. Destroy the shield. And he should be going down pretty quickly. Okay, reload. Who do we hit? Probably this guy. Or no, this guy. There's no risk of hitting our own people, and we got 72%. And we missed. Of course we did. Right, now what? We need to kill this raider down here. But easier said than done. He is attacking us. I need either rotation or knockback. That's what we need. Hey, that's just rude. I'm still going to hit him, obviously. Oh, we killed him! Well, that solves that problem. Alright. Come on, people. Let's get this done. This area is a little bit too crowded at this point. Uh, let's knock him back into the low ground. Try at least. Yep, nice. So now we got high ground on him. Okay. Yeah, he will be going down pretty easily. He's already breaking. Oh, wait, right, there's one more dude in the front. Whoops. My bad. One down. Come on, let's hit someone. Let's destroy the shield. Here we go. And then the guy with thrown weapons. Or the guy with a flail, because he doesn't have a shield anymore. Here, he's dead. I think we are pretty much done here. Well, not literally, but we are about to be done. These are raiders, however. They can do some good damage. Even when we don't expect it. So let's be careful still. Yeah, he's still trying. That was actually a decent hit. Right there. Let's try to kill him quickly. Before he does too much damage to Herman. Come on. There we go, he's almost dead. Grazed neck, pierced leg muscles. He's almost dead, we only need to hit him like one more time. Come on, seriously, you missed? Okay. Well then. I can't really hit him without the risk of hitting my own dude. No. There we go, he's dead. We didn't give him a chance to attack again. Let's finish this. And go collect our pay. Come on, people. Let's get this done. There we go, he's fleeing. We only got one more raider to deal with. Won't take long. Okay, move in. He will start fleeing soon, I think. He's already breaking. And we're almost done. Hopefully we'll get a level up from this. There goes his shield. And he's dead. Nice. We didn't get any level ups, but we got some good experience. Almost 200 for Holstein. Nice. Alright then. And we got some nice gear. We got nice armor and we got some pretty good helmets. 140. Okay, good. I will definitely take that. Time to go back and get paid. 
First, let's check the gear, shall we? Just in case something happens on the way. So, first the armor. And the helmets. 140. Someone in the front should be using that one. Like Randolph. Yep, Randolph has the worst helmet out of anyone in the front line right now. Okay, here you go then. So now we got a 95 helmet. With minus 8 fatigue penalty. Minus 8 is fine. We can give that to Oscar. So here you go, and we got one more with 110. Otwin can get that. We got one more with 70. Uh, I'm keeping Fangshire on the crossbowman. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, our worst helmet has plus 70 armor. What about the shirt? 110. Let's check armor in the front. 95. 115. 95. 55. Okay, Corin is that one. So there you go. And I think that's it. 55 is our worst armor now. Uh, or not. It took some damage, but I guess we'll just repair it. Okay, 50 is our worst armor now. Let's move on. Go back and get paid. So now we'll have almost 5000. Just under 5000. And we'll go do some shopping, definitely. I need some good recruits. Let's check recruits in here. There it is. So. What else do they have? They have a tavern. They have a barber. Yeah, well, I don't need that. And obviously a harbor. So, are these guys any good? Killer on the run? No. Thief. Rat catcher. Caravan hand. Apprentice. No, I think I'll pass. Fisherman can be okay. But I'm looking for a good ranged. And possibly a good tank. So we are going to check out other towns. Uh, do we want to improve our morale? 60. Yeah, we could do that. Well, our morale is already pretty good. Everyone is in good spirit. 60%, 60%. Yeah, I don't think that's needed. Anyway, that's going to be the end of this episode, so thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did, or a dislike if you didn't. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.